The Northwest Museum of Arts and Culture presents Storytime with the Mac, sponsored by STCU. Today's story is Birds Can't Read, written and illustrated by V. Moa, read with permission from the author. This is a book about birds. Plop. This little creature is a bird. His name is Sammy. Well, of course I'm a bird. Do I look like a mouse or an elephant to you? Birds are fascinating creatures. Let's learn more about them. I don't have time for this. I'd rather take a nap. Sammy is going to help us learn about birds. Um, I would love to. Really, I would. But I'm very busy right now. Are there any other birds here who can help? Anyone? Anyone at all? How about you? Can you be a bird and help out? Fine, I'll do it. What is it that you need me to do? Birds have wings. Huh? Birds have wings. Oh, I get it. I'm supposed to show my wings, right? Here, are you happy now? Birds have two legs. Of course birds have two legs. Have you ever seen a three-legged bird? Birds do not have teeth. Yep, that's right. Are you jealous? In fact, I've never had a cavity in my life. Birds do not chew their food. How can I chew my food? I don't have teeth, remember? I prefer to swallow my food. Besides, chewing takes too long. Some birds are intelligent and are capable of using tools. That's me, all right. I am great with tools. Oh, you don't believe me? Would you like me to demonstrate? Why don't you hand me a tool? Any tool at all. Huh? What's this? A hammer? Oh, I knew it was a hammer. I was just testing you. Here. Let me show you how to use it. It's not working. I think this hammer is broken. Is this how you hold a hammer? No? Which way am I supposed to hold it? Like this? Oh, I knew that. I was just testing you again. Let me show you how to use this. Smack! Ouch! It hurts! It hurts! Oh, maybe I'm not as handy as I think. Now, what were we doing again? I remember we were learning about birds. Birds are warm-blooded animals. That's right. I don't need to bask in the sun to stay warm like this snake. Birds can lay eggs. Huh? Plop. Hold on a second. 
Let's get one thing straight. Only female birds lay eggs. I am a male bird. I do not lay eggs. Oh, would you look at the time? It's getting late. I have to go now. We're done learning about birds, right? Birds can't read. Excuse me? Birds can't read. Is this a joke? Birds can't read? How ridiculous! Who told you birds can't read? I want their name and address. I'm going to have a serious talk with that person. Birds can read. In fact, I've read many, many books. And I'll have you know, I was reading the moment I came out of my egg. Oh, it's true. And quite frankly, I'm insulted that you think birds can't read. Can you read? Well, good for you. You know, there's a lot about me that you don't know. Not only can I read, I can laugh, I can cry, I can dance, and I can sing. You know, in some ways, we are a lot alike. Wouldn't you agree? And. To prove to you that I can read, I will read you a bedtime story. Go ahead and get comfortable. This morning will be the coldest morning of the week. Temperatures will start in the teens with strong winds blowing from the east. Expect rain showers later in the afternoon. This is today's forecast. What? You, you don't like my bedtime story? It's not a bedtime story. It's the weather forecast. I know that. Reading the weather forecast is the perfect bedtime story. It makes me sleepy. <sighs> you see, I'm ready for bed now. And by the way, I told you so. Birds can read. <laughs>